This mission will demand advanced assault tactics using the dual warhead armament of the missile boat. The target is Tarak's TIE Defender manufacturing facility, cargo containers and all craft in the area. The facility's anti-warhead defense system is augmented with a large Type C minefield. Tarak's forces are loyal, well trained and now very well equipped with TIE defenders, T-wings and Y-wings. Admiral Thrawn will lead the attack personally from his flagship, the Imperial Star Destroyer Grey Wolf. TIE interceptor groups Alpha and Gamma will engage the starfighter defenses and protect Grey Wolf. Missile boat Mu-1 will eliminate the factory's defenses to clear the way for TIE bomber group Beta's attack. For the greater glory of the Empire, destroy everything! Hey guys, welcome back to some more TIE fighter. Now, this mission can get a little bit tough if you get impatient. So if you just sort of sit back and, you know, take your pot shots with your missiles at the minefield, because it's a Type C minefield, that's the one where you shoot it and then it shoots missiles back at you. Yeah, if you just take your time, then that'll be fine, and you just need to get on destroying those TIE defenders quite quickly. Uh, some rebels do turn up right at the very end, and you can hang around and blow them up, save some missiles for it if you like, or just up the, uh, the speed, and then you can take them all out. I mean, you take out the starfighters normally, but take out the big cruisers by just upping the speed and blast them with your laser because you'll have no missiles by that point. Anyway, cloak figure. Tarek has attracted the interest of Admiral Thrawn. He sees in her a resemblance to himself. Having convinced the Emperor of her value, he has been directed to capture her alive. She is going to be offered the opportunity to serve the Emperor as Thrawn does. When the factory shields fail, she will attempt to escape. You will need to assist Assault Gunboat Tau in stopping her craft. You don't have an ion cannon, but you can reduce her ship's shields, making it easier for Assault Gunboat Tau to disable. Woo! All right, we can do that. Not a problem. Let's go. Okay, laser's gone up, we've taken our beam weapon off, we're going to target this thing first, the facility, it's warhead Engage launcher. The overdrive and accelerate past those T -wings. Now. Okay, so we should blow right past some T-wings, you probably Try won't even see them, the oh, there they are. Far left. And we'll also blow past, oh wait, no, those were friendlies. We're blowing past the T-wings now? One. Don't forget to take out the factory's warhead launcher. Yeah, yeah, there they are. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Okay, so we're gonna take out that- Mew 1, incoming missile. Shields behind. Wait, just balanced. Okay, so... Yeah, it'll be fine. Right, let's get some shield regen happening, just because we've got that missile, which is gonna hit us with sh shields to the back. So, we're gonna hit the warhead launcher, and then we're gonna move over. There we go. And we're going to deal with- Careful. Can't afford to lose that missile boat. Yeah. Um, over right here. Z3. There you go. Red Devil 2, Red Devil 1. Okay. Red Devil 3 is closest. So we're going to line up on him. And then we're gonna. Let's rename this factory one target, shall we? <laughs> You're so cool and funny. Whatever. So we're gonna hit you with those missiles, and then we're gonna hit you. Remember to stay outside the facility's Those gun missiles. range. Two kilometers. You. Excellent hunting. Excellent Those kill. and then pull down Four. and boost away. Excellent work. Brilliant. Okay. Now. T-wing group Pinsa has been eliminated. Oh, minefield. Oh, minefield. Oh, minefield. Okay. I'm gonna slam in. Shoot and pull away. Nice. Pull one. one. Okay, gotta be, gotta be good with those slam systems. Okay, cool. So now that these guys are up and about, we're going to increase power to that beam weapon system. Gonna leave our shield regen where it was, and we're gonna try and get in behind this guy once we've got some power into our beam system. Oh, dear. 
Okay. Now we get a lock and we kill him. And we hold it and we boost away now. There's Blue Devil 3. Oh, hello. Wow, he is, he is quite close. All right, so we're going to drop that beam power to normal just because this is the last person that we're going to have to hold with it. Okay. And as soon as we can get a decent line on him. There he is. Nope. Okay. Not there it is. There. Yep. There we go. Got him. Mission critical craft under attack. Yes. Okay. The Grey Wolf is under attack. The interceptors will handle you. Du -du -du. Actually, you know what? I'm going to take those out with lasers because, you know, that makes sense. Also, the, um... Oh, we have to do with the minefield. Forget about that. Alright. Mines, lots of mines, containers, Y wings are still around. Okay, so minefield first off. Kill the engines. Swap over to missiles. Have a single missile ready to launch. Get rid of that beam power, because I'm not going to need that for anything. Um, there you are. Get a lock and fire, and then swap over to lasers. That one. Target the missile, missile, start coming in towards us, and shoot it out of the air. We have to do this, I believe it's 32 times. Yay! So, get that one, and target the next one as well. And then get ready for two missiles incoming. That's the first one. Incoming missile. And next missile. There we go. Incoming missile. So... This is a thing which we're going to have to do, and you may get impatient, you may want to just fly through it and blow them all up that way, but don't, because it's it's the it's the missile ones, you know, don't, don't be stupid. If you do that, then you'll die and you'll have to start all over again. As I did several times. Mew 1, incoming missile. Doop, doop, doop. And... Mew 1, incoming doop. missile. And... Oh, oh, he's getting closer. He's getting closer. Can I do it? Can I get him out of the air? Yes. Yes, I can. Not not even a question. Okay. Next is that one. And then... Oh, uh, you're just out of range. Uh, yeah, that one. There we go. Uh, lasers. And... There we go. Incoming missile. Uh, so, I might speed through this, just because it's... Uh, Incoming missile. It's Flying just this. Okay, dokey. Mew one, incoming missile. All right, so that's all of the missiles at um, at the bottom taken down. So now we just have all these missiles at the top to take down, and I'm gonna show you where I'm going to sit for that, in case that's what you are here for. Going to slam. Half the are cleared. Keep going, one. And dodge those lasers with no trouble at all. Fly through all that. And then cut power. There we go. Once we hit about 2Ks, we swing around because we're still going incredibly fast. I only want to keep them at about 2Ks, just under. Doop, doop, doop. Until our speed drops to nothing. Throw some more power into shields. I mean, why not, right? Okay. So. Right. So let's start at this corner, and we'll just work our way up. And... All right now, this point. Let us go and take these out the old fashioned way because these last four I think we can do without a problem. Mew one, incoming missile. 
you or incoming missile. Oh jeez. Never seen a missile turn that hard before in my life. You or incoming missile. Come on. Whoop. 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 Okay, we're just docking him now. You want incoming missile. Okay, where's the last one? Alright, it's all Target gone. Destroyed. Brilliant, okay. Alright, so the main facility is shooting me, despite the fact that it's under rocket attack from, you know, TIE bombers. But I guess I am in, like, the crazy prototype ship, so... That's fair enough. Let's go and blow these containers up. Because why not? I mean, it's part of the mission objectives, and that's why. Um... Ugh. We could, for example, hit them with missiles. Three missiles will take it out. But I sort of want to save the missiles. Uh, the thing is, we only have a single laser, and it gets drained very, very quickly. And because it's only a single laser, it does not do much damage. You. There's more bombers. Alright, where have we got? One, two. Okay. Uh, da, da, da. Pie one. Wait, where is it? Oh, it's up there. Okay. Yeah, we, we got that. Not a problem. You know what? I'm gonna fire that missile just so we've got 17 and 17 rather than 17 and 18. Then I'm gonna go in with my lasers. Target destroyed. Yay! Alright. Oh, Pi 2. Let's slow down to one third power and. Urgh. Yeah, see, this is the whole looking straight down thing which we're trying to talk about. Trying to talk about, which I was talking about. It's really hard to actually hold that angle. So if you go just off of, um, if you aim just off of straight down or straight up, you'll actually be able to hold that angle. Target destroyed. Oh, just waiting on this guy. Be destroyed by all these bombers. What are they doing? Flying home. Oh, did you get too damaged, did you? Jeez, alright. Let's hit some missiles, shall we? Boop. Boop. Right. How'd that do? Wow, that does not do much damage at all, does it? I guess we do need rockets to take it out. Well, alright, let's fly around a bit then, shall we? Just for a bit of fun, why not? Just waiting for our teammates to get here. Alright, so where are those... Can we take out those laser turrets? I wonder. I mean, probably, but they're turrets rather than guns, so it's going to be quite hard. So the laser guns, which you'll find on outposts and things like that, will just be like a triangle sticking up out of nowhere. And you can actually take those out fairly easily with lasers. That's why I'm really actually fairly confident taking on a uh, Lake Mon Calamari cruiser in a missile boat, even if I don't have missiles. Well, actually no, I would like missiles to take out their warhead launchers, but you know what I mean. Because um, they can just do sort of quick runs on it, you're like, oh, okay, cool, 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 and that's a dead laser cannon, and that's a dead laser cannon, and then you do the same for laser turrets, but they take a little bit longer to do. Even strength. Keep pumping those shields up. Ugh. Where are we going? Can I hit the laser? Okay. Waiting on Tarek to run away screaming so we can go and... Yeah! See? Missile turret gone. Hey, look! 
Kremlin transport. Where was it? I can just press that button. Hello. The facility. Target yeah. destroyed. Excellent work. Yep. Mu one. Primary objectives completed. Mu one. Your combat piloting skills are unsurpassed. You've proven the ultimate superiority of the missile boat. Oh, I did set a slam button down here. Oh, I've been pressing N. God damn, I just. <laughs> All this time I'm like over here to press the slip. No, it's just there. It's right there on my. It's. I set it to that button. That button. Go. That's embarrassing. <laughs> oh jeez, these A wings are quite a while away. Okay, let's get ready. What are you going after? Tie Bomber Beta 4. Alright. Alright. So, that's a dead A Wing. Excellent hunting, Mew 1. Good work, that's Mew a dead A Wing. Dead X Wings. Good work. Oof. Oh, he clipped me. He clipped me. Alright. Not a problem. Where I hold still. Oh. Oh. Oh, that, that's gotta hurt. Look, the strike cruiser's arrived. Dun, da, da. So, these guys you could take out fairly handily. Uh, dual fire on that warhead launcher, then dual fire on that warhead launcher, and then does this guy have a warhead launcher? Uh, he scooby dooby doo. And then this guy, warhead launcher. There you go. So, all the warhead launchers are down, which is great fire off the rest of our missiles. Do do do. We call for reinforcements just for a bit of fun. And then, see what I was talking about? Those triangles sticking off. You can easily take those out. Like so. Oh dear. Where's that coming from? Did I not take out a, um, one of the warhead launchers? No, you seem alright. Okay. Oh, it must be just an A-Wing. Alright, buddy. I'm out of missiles, but I'll still take you on. Because I'm quick. Speedy. And my one laser will get you. Also, I've got a beam, a, uh, a beam weapon, so you're not really going to run away. I can't call my teammates to kill him. Ugh. Lame. Doop, doop, doop. Okay. Yeah, hold still. 
Hold still. I mean, I'm not tracking you or anything, but hopefully my teammates will get to you eventually. Eh, uh, screw the weapon. Oh, hello. <laughs> my teammates did get to him. Take that missile. And another one. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So, back to this guy. So that's the top of the... Well, I call it the top. I think it's the top? Possibly it's actually the bottom. Either way, this side... This is the side where I've actually taken out some of the guns. Oh, pull up! Oh, jeez! Oh, I was going a lot faster than I thought I was. Oh, buddy. Okay, um... So... Once you do a few runs on this guy and you take out the laser guns, then you can start doing a few runs to take out the laser turrets. I'm really, really doing this until the capture operation is done. I mean, you can hang around if you like and take it out entirely, you know, and by all means do that. But it will take a very, very long time because you would have used up all of your missiles carefully taking out that minefield. Let's actually get some shield regen in there. That. Pull down. Way. So cool. Capture operation complete. Yay. Excellent work, Mu One. Secondary mission objectives completed. Outstanding, Mu One. The Emperor will be very pleased. Return to the Grey Wolf at once for an honor ceremony. And that's how you do it. Um, yeah, so I'll, I'll show you taking out all of the... Actually, you know what? Screw it. I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to take it, take this guy out. So, that's... I believe most of the laser guns on him taken out. I like this one, Sykes. You don't have to bother taking out the guns on the other side, because you just stay on this side. And he can't actually hit you. Which is good and useful. Uh, you know. So then... Take those out, and everything becomes much easier. Look at that! Just like that, he can't damage you if you just stay on this side of him, unless you run into him. <laughs> cool. So you just do that. I would increase the time, so I would go time at four times. I'll wait for lasers to go back up to full. And then... Ah! Overdrive, 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 overdrive. Okie dokie, alright. Come down like that. Okay. Shield recharge at full. Slow it right down. I want to be out here. Out here works. Notice his uh, shields are down. His hull is decreasing. And he's uh, running away from thing. So if you leave it, then he'll actually go and try and attack the Star Destroyer. And then once he gets close enough to the Star Destroyer, the Star Destroyer starts attacking him as well. And if you've been doing all this. This guy will be above the Star Destroyer, so he won't be able to attack the Star Destroyer because he's above him and he's got no guns on his underside because you destroyed them all. So, just go like this. And all the teammates will be attacking him, as you can see. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to destroy him in time. But one can hope. Uh, especially with your teammates' help. Maybe. But again, we only have the one little piddly gun. Does not do much damage. It runs out of charge quite quickly. Target destroyed. Yay! Nice. And out of curiosity. Oh wow, there's a combat utility vehicle which we could have been recharging at. God damn it, where are you? Transmission received, Mew 1. 
Why did I never get a message being like, yo, you can recharge now? God damn. Alright. Drop shields to that. In fact, drop shield power entirely. I want to get there as quickly as possible. Let's come on and slam. And welcome to Japan. Alright. It's gonna do that. We're gonna load up fully. Then we're gonna look at that guy. I'm just gonna hit him with 40 misses. Doom! Ugh, it'll be good fun. Let's set that to no power. Let's get those shields back up, shall we? Wow, we are gonna overshoot him a lot. Goodbye. Coming around. And by coming around, I mean just doing a big loop repeatedly until I stop. There he is. Okay. There we go. Shields are full. That's good. Let's increase the time. Begin reload operation. Yeah. This guy, what's he doing? He's following flight plan. He's so dead. Oh, we're going to ruin his day. Okay. We want all 40 missiles. I don't think it'll take 40 missiles, but... Ooh. Come on. Come on, load me up. 30. 34. 38. Okay, wait. I've been doing ma maths. Math wrong. Either way, we're at 40 now. Reload oh. operation okay. complete. Where are ya? There you are. Hello, my friend. Let's go about there and just hold down the trigger. Okay, yeah, we got it. We didn't take, didn't take all the missiles. Three left over, and I'm sure there was some which were just on the way. Secret mission objectives completed. All right, I'm happy with that. Okay. How does it feel to be a legend? Sorry, it's, it's that, isn't it? Whatever the kids are doing these days. Is dabbing still a thing? I don't know. I'm too old, apparently. Okay. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Boom. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Admiral Thrawn, I am promoting you to Grand Admiral for your obedient service to the Empire. You will join my inner circle of twelve Grand Admirals who will command all Imperial forces for the glory of the Empire. Emperor, your faith in me is well placed. How may I serve you next? You must track down Zarin and destroy his forces once and for all. Grand Admiral Thrawn, do not fail me. The traitor Zyrin cannot run forever. Soon he will be in our grasp. Yay! There we go, guys. And we have... We have destroyed Tarak's TIE Defender factory. The threat of proliferation of TIE Defenders has been greatly reduced. Only Zarin retains the TIE Defender, but Admiral Thrawn has developed the Trump Card, the missile boat, which you proved in the last battle to be the ultimate starfighter in the galaxy. Congratulations on your unsurpassed combat fighter prowess. You must join Thrawn in the hunt for Zari. Only the two of you can make him feel the full might of Imperial justice. yip -wee. Right, and quick figure says... You enabled the capture of the Nami leader Tarak. The Emperor will be very pleased. He is looking forward to meeting his new servant. You and Admiral Thrawn will both be rewarded well for your outstanding service to the Empire. Yeah. Rewarded with a gift card. Right. Uh, join us next time, guys, where we move on to the next battle. It is battle... What number is it? Uh... 
Battle 11, Hunt for Zarin. I think there was like 12 or 13 battles? I can't remember. Um, someone told me at some stage. Either way, join us next time when we will be hunting for Zarin. Probably in a missile boat. Possibly in a TIE Defender. Maybe in like a TIE Advance. Who knows? Bye.